concepts, no one's lacking stuff, but it's not enough when it seems that we have enough stuff just to blow stuff up. Like Stopping a lot, guys. I have to, because this is just incredible. Beautiful wings if we accomplish the things. Pride straight laying low at the feet of the king. I need beautiful wings if we accomplish the things. Keep me in. What's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to Game Changers, guys. Back with another reaction. Guys, 21 Pilots Tuesdays. Uh, this is actually a Tyler Joseph song. It's called Blasphemy. I'm excited to get into it. Tara Newell, you get the shout out for today. Thank you so much for the support on the channel. Guys, we're almost at 10K subs. Make sure you drop a subscribe. Don't cost you anything. Just help a brother out. So, Christian Page, if you're new, welcome. Uh, we just uh, we give glory to God in every video that we do, and we're excited to get into this, guys. I'm going to shut up so we can get into it. Tyler Joseph, 21 Pilots, they're banging. I love them, and we're going to get into it. So, Tyler Joseph, blasphemy. Let's get it. Piano, baby. I start two parts, two halves of my heart in the dark and I don't know where I should go when the tears and the fears begin to multiply. Mm, I don't know where I should go. Uh-oh, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Already stopping. I don't know where to go when the tears and the darkness multiply. Or, I'm paraphrasing, but anyway, he's about to come in hard. Here we go. It's got a little uh, Linkin Park sound to it right here. Dark and I don't know where I should go when the tears and the fears begin to multiply. Taking time in a simple place in my bed when my head rests on a pillowcase and the sand that I was there, but I forget that I let another day go by. I wanna be afraid, but it seems that these days I'm caught under wondering. I'm falling farther, my heart's getting harder. I'm calling my father in. I scream into an empty sky. Yep. I call to my father, guys. Sometimes we gotta hit rock bottom to start looking up, guys. It's true, man. And sometimes, God, listen, God allows things to happen like that so that we get put back in line, okay? I'd rather have short-term pain so that I can be with my father long-term, so. And that's the Heavenly Father. Let's go. I'm caught under wondering, I'm falling farther, my heart's getting harder, I'm calling my father in. I scream into an empty sky, empty sky, no way, that's me, cause one half of my heart is free. Empty sky, no way, that's me, cause the other half of my heart's asleep. The other half of my heart is asleep, guys. How many of us can relate to that? When I was in college, I was playing. I was teeter totter on both sides of the fence. I wanted to give God my all. I wanted to give him all my bur burdens. I wanted to give him all my all that, but I didn't want to give him all my sin. I wanted to still uh, divulge in some of that. So, And that's just being real. I'm being honest and vulnerable with you guys. But it wasn't until I gave it all to God and I repented of all my sins that he really gripped a hold of my heart. Here we go. Sing a song but don't believe. Blasphemy is just for me. Help a crib. Take your fear. Guys, he came in hard. He came in hard in that first verse and then up until this point, guys. Can I understand you? We can't fully grasp the goodness and the greatness of our God because we are in a box and God is outside of that box. But what we can understand and what we can grasp is his word and what he gives us, all right? And he gives us absolute truths, all right? This world will tell you that there's gray area and all that stuff. And there's not. Listen, there's absolute truths, all right? Jesus is Lord, okay? It says it in the scriptures. Repent of our sins, and we need to give our lives to Christ. He loves us, guys. Listen, I'm telling you, it's the best life you can live. This song is banging. Let's go. Lights, camera, action, satisfaction. At your fingertips, no one's lacking stuff. But it's not enough when it seems that we have enough stuff just to blow stuff up. Lights. <laughs> Stopping a lot, guys. I have to, because this is just incredible. Listen, we have a lot of stuff, but a lot of stuff is not enough. He's preaching to the choir right now. He's preaching to the choir, guys. Listen, the best things in life you can't buy. You can't buy. It's lacking stuff, but it's not enough when it seems that we have enough stuff just to blow stuff up. Lights, camera, stop. We're killing ourselves just to get to the top, and I won't stop talking about what we got and how we're not loving what we're off the lot. Enough about you, let's talk about me, and everybody thinks I'm just so free. Free, did you hear the verse that came first, and how my own body went to war on me? I bet you didn't know something that's absurd, there's a word that said more than any other word. It's sorry, sorry, and I pray that our word was heard. Sing a song. Can I pray that my word was heard, guys? Listen, and he said, you think I'm free? He said, look at the first verse I was just singing about. That's a bar, man. That is a bar. Let's go. Can I see your eyes? 
is a worship song. I say it all the time. Listen, a lot of times we go to church and we hear certain worship songs. And they all kind of, I don't want to say they sound the same, but it's the same framework. You know what I mean? So like people look at this song and they'd be like, oh, that's not a worship song. But it is. I mean, if you look at the lyrics, it's not all about the beat and, and the screaming and all that stuff. It's about the lyrics. You know what I mean? And he's crushing it with this. I love the message that he's saying here. And listen, we're all hypocrites if you think about it, all right? A lot of people think, a lot of people outside of the faith think that Christians think that they're perfect. And a lot of times it's our fault too because we try to put on a persona like we are perfect. But listen, that's not the gospel. The gospel is that we are hurting people and we need Jesus, all right? And listen, if you read the scriptures, we can have full confidence in the Lord when we are saved, but it doesn't mean that we're not going to sin anymore. We fall short every single day. That's the whole point of needing Jesus and, and our Savior. So, guys, if you're watching and you're a non-believer, I, I apologize um, for that persona, but that's not what it's all about. It's we're, we're hurting people just like you, and we know that we need a Savior, okay? If you're not at that point yet, listen, I pray for you. I pray for you to understand that you have purpose. And listen, there's a God that loves you, man. There's a God that loves you. Joseph blasphemy. It's the 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 production with Twenty One Pilots is obviously better than than when Tyler Joseph is just by himself. But the especially as being a believer in Christ, the the lyrics just hit differently when it's just Tyler Joseph's stuff. And I know that might that might rub some people the wrong way, but that's just my opinion. You know what I mean? And that's just. We all have different opinions. We all have different tastes and things of that nature. But there's something about these songs, man, that just... I love how he doesn't hold, a ba he doesn't hold back about sharing the gospel. And it's just a beautiful thing, guys. It's a beautiful thing. And I love how he has broken into mainstream music and that they have such a following because it's important to hear this message. And, um, man. And that's not a knock at 21 Pilots because 21 Pilots, man, they, they are incredible too. And I love what he's doing with that band as well. Because there's a place for both, you know what I mean? There's a place for worship songs, and there's also a place for bands like 21 Pilots, Switchfoot, things of that nature, that they don't necessarily sing Jesus, Jesus, Jesus in every single lyric, but they kind of, they do in a, in, a, um, in a subliminal way, and that reaches people that might not enter a church, you know what I mean, things of that nature. So both are beautiful, and it's all about, and then people are like, oh, well, how do you know which one you want to do? It's what God's calling you to do. There's, God has given us each gifts, and we need to follow through with what God has given us and the gifts that he has given us and what he is calling us to do. And it's important for us to really be tapped into our relationship with Christ and being in his word and understanding when he's talking to us and when, when it might be the devil that's talking to us instead. So, because not every, not every voice that we're hearing is from the Lord. That's why we need to know the scriptures. So, guys, this is beautiful. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, continue to follow the page, continue to follow the journey. We're giving glory to God in every single video. Guys, continue to give recommendations because I'm hitting every single one that you guys give me. Might be a while, but I'll hit it. I promise. God bless. Catch you on the next video.